What's up, dude? Sir, how are you, man? I'm good, how are you? I'm absolutely amazing. Let's get it. Let's absolutely get it. Thanks for having me. Yeah. This is fun. It's so fun. Yeah. It's so fun. You've done an amazing job. Thank you. It's the best game. It's the best game. All right, post. Sir. Pleasure to be here. Thank you brother. for having This is exciting for both of us. Yes, sir. I gotta say, one of the coolest parts about the past year was finding out that you play hunt. It's, I, my buddy Scott got me into it and I've had the game for the, probably the better half of this last year. And whenever I'm on the road and I I'm, can't play, I'm always missing it. And I've got about like 400 hours on it. <laughs> so there, your buddy, Scott got you into yes, it. Yes, sir. All right, what made you like fall in love with the game? I love how it's based and grounded in reality. Like very quick time to kill. Mm -hmm. You can body somebody in one shot. The guns are so sick. The coolest, the skins are so sick. And I was like, all right, I'm gonna give this a go. And then I used Necro for the first time and I was like. It takes about like 100 hours before you really get the feel yes, of sir. what this game is. How long do you think it took you to kind of get like your mind wrapped around all the intricacies on Hunt? I don't know. I, I'd say, I wouldn't say 100 hours. To understand everything, I'm still figuring it out. I feel like that. what firearms are what. But I don't know about 50, maybe, or 100, I, maybe 50 hours it took to like, the horses do this. I try, I, I'm getting my brother and couple of my friends in the game and I'm like, you see, all right, so anyone you see, throw your knife at them, walk up to them, pull it out, they'll die. Right. Do not stab the fire guys. <laughs> I call them the fire guys. I like, do not, you see a fiery maniac, don't stab him or shoot him or anything. But it's so awesome. And once you nail it, you feel so good because you're walking around the woods and you're like, wait, you know you hear dudes. Yeah and you know where they are. Now, obviously, audio is super important. And you did such an incredible job on the, like, I don't know if it's spatial audio, mm -hmm. I don't, but where, where stuff is, it's, right. it's pretty awesome. And you can even hear, and, and opposed to other games, you can hear people ADSing. Yeah. And you're like, okay, I hear him outside the wall. It's a wooden wall. I hear him right there. Yeah. I'm gonna blast him. <laughs> I'm gonna blast him. And then you get it and you're like, yes, this is yeah. the best feeling. It's I'm so gonna make a montage whenever I get home. Montage? I got clips, I'm gonna send you my All montage. All right, so here's my question. What's the song that you put on top of the montage? Uh, no, I don't know. Um, I have I have the mm -hmm on my yeah. soundboard in Discord. Um, I, I, you know, it's a little drummer boy. Or a TikTok uh, by Kesha. <laughs> and I'm just bodying dudes through walls. Right. I got good clips. Tell I'm a wall bang. I'm a big wall bang. So obviously we have a star rating system. You know, you can be a one star, which yes, is kind of like the bottom of the totem pole, and then you have a six star, which is the highest. Where do you fall skill? -wise? I've never been six. I've been five. Okay. On my KDs, it's hard, and it's hard to maintain a KD. And I it know is. a lot of people don't care about KD yep. because there's two ways to play. Mm -hmm. You either play the game, or you can sit in a bush and have a high KD. Yep. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. Um, my KD's about one, two, one. It's a good KD, yeah. cause I play hard. Let's say you were playing Hunt. You have money on the line. Yes, sir. What's your loadout? What's your two guns that you're bringing in? If I'm try hard sweating, I use the crag before you buffed it. Okay. So I use the crag before you buffed it. And now that it's better, yeah. I still use it yeah. naturally. People say Mosin Dolch. I like the Dolch. I don't like how, it doesn't make me feel as cool as I do mm. with a revolver. Right. So I'll take an uppercut. I'll just take, I'll take a crag and an uppercut if I'm sweating. I'm not missing either, so, duh. Actually. <laughs> uh, um, then we go down, I'll take spear, flare gun, concertina bomb, health kit. Yeah. Regeneration shot. Stamina shot, concertina traps, ammo box, necromancer, resilience, magpie, assailant, silent killer, conduit, serpent, uh, doctor, physician, 
I got this. Uh, dude. I got this stuff. Yeah. I got. That's I got awesome. this stuff. I died yeah, a lot. Yeah, yeah. I died a lot. <laughs> and that's. I put the cool skin on, and I'm like, oh, this dude's definitely a little fifty. And then I die the first time. I'm like, oh fuck. You know, <laughs> you know what I think? Shoot. Peacekeeper. It should be a permanent perk. You think so? Yes. I think it's that good. I think that is so gangster. Yeah. Because you actually got to do something to actually make it work. You got to actually win to make it work. And I think that's awesome. So, one of the things me and you have already talked about. Bunch, yes, sir. Future additions to the game. Sure. What's a mechanic or an addition to the game that you'd like to see that we don't have? We talked about, I, I like leaning. I, I've always said leaning. Leaning okay. would be awesome. I talk about my perk. Go for Let's go for it. Okay. Trait is holding some rounds in between your fingers mm -hmm. as, you, as you're holding your rifle so you can reload that much faster. You, faster. you don't got to reach down and grab the round and put it in. Pretend this. Pretend this Tropic Thunder is a Springfield trapdoor rifle. 4570. Um, so here, here, I like boom, boom, boom. I shot a guy. Loser. So dead. He's so dead, I already killed him. Pop it up, pops out, and you already got one right here. I can grab this and put it right there instead of reaching into my stuff. Dude, that's so satisfying to shoot and so satisfying to get a kill with. That's kind of what drew me into the game, is you're either 100% in or you're done. Yeah. You know, I could either rock this dude and send him off or I'm totally naked. Yep. You know, and, and that kind of gamble is like, I shake every game I'm, shaking and I'm like, this is awesome, dude. Yeah. Whenever you pull it off, you're like, I'm the best. I'm yeah. the best player in the entire world. All right, so staying on future things. Right? Yes, sir. So when you think about, you know, we just released newest map, map four, we went into yes, Colorado, whole new biome, right? What do you think is a good biome that we should explore in the future that would work really well with the Hunt universe? Um, first off, I want snow. Okay. Where you can see the footprints. Yeah. And it doesn't have to be like, they don't have to stay forever. They can right. stay for a certain amount of time and then, you know, fade away kind of. Yeah. But I think that would bring a really awesome dynamic. And even then you can prank people. You can say, oh, footprints going this way. And people are following the footprints and their buddies sitting there right there with the Springfield waiting for them to go into the, to the, wherever the other footprints led them. I yeah. think that would be amazing. Um, a more urban area, more buildings, like crazy condensed kind of crazy. where, yeah. yeah, and more maybe like crazy condensed, a lot of, a lot of cover, hard to see people, very, like, a lot of places to hide. Like a city would be killer. Like I think that would be awesome. And not full city, you can even be like half and half. Like you spread right. it down the middle, and then you go to this side yeah. of the map, and then it's just like he, a big ass city. I yeah. think that would be killer. Put them both together, snowy city. I think that would be fun, and. I think that would lead to a lot of interesting gameplay, and I think um, there's a lot of cool places uh, for me to sh shoot idiots. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's my pitch. If you put a guitar as an equipment slot, it does nothing but make noise constantly, and you're playing these songs on the guitar, and you're bringing people in, and also it's awesome. Right. You just have the guitar. Yeah. You're waiting for the bounty. Yeah. You're waiting for it to, to banish and you're just playing the guitar. And then you're running to extract playing the guitar. Costs a thousand uh, hunt bucks and then you got a guitar. You can melee with it and it gets slowly more detuned and the cracked over off. time. Yeah, that yeah, sounds that's awesome. Yeah. We'll add it to the list. Let's, no, it's in the game. <laughs> it's in the game. So you have a big arsenal win. Sir. What's a weapon that you have in your arsenal that you would want to bring into hunt? If you had, I'll give you, I'll give you three. Okay. You could bring three in. Or okay. one. Oh, that's one to three. hard. I know. That's why I don't have any weapons? More. Any of the weapons you have. Periodically correct. Periodically correct, yes. Oh, shit. Single action with, I think it, they call it a uh, Bisley grip. It's okay. It's a different grip. It's like a more straight. So single action is hard, ha kind of tricky to hold. Yeah. It's meant to be shot with like one hand. I don't know if that's one I would bring. This is so hard. I'll make it easy. Okay. Let's go somewhere between period correct and call it 10 to 15 years. Okay. 
If we do 10 or 15 years, obviously 1911. Dead. Obviously 1911. That's a good one. Obviously 1911. 1911. Um, Springfield 1903. You could do a melee weapon if you want. Oh, yeah. I want, oh, yeah. Uh, duh. That's so easy. I want to take a framing hammer. I want to bring, I want to beat hammer. the shit out of a, so, <laughs> out of context, that sounds wild. I want to beat someone up in the video game, Hunt Showdown, with a framing hammer. Your recent album came out, right? Sure. And you collaborated with a lot of different artists. Yes, sir. Inside of there, right? Yes, sir. Which one do you think would be the best at Hunt Showdown? Oh. Dolly Parton. Dolly Parton is <laughs> she the perfect killer. answer. She might be killer at it. You never know. For sure. I think probably Hardy. Yeah? I think probably Hardy would be. Okay. I don't know if he plays or anything, and but I think he'd probably be killer at FPSs, I feel like. Okay. I don't know what Luke plays. It was either him or Luke. Well, then you gotta look into who has better hearing. Hardy listens to his music louder, probably. So mm -hmm. I'll give it to Luke then, if that's the question. We'll take it. Luke Combs, best hunt player. <laughs> on the album. Perfect. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, rapid fire. You ready for this? I don't think so. <laughs> I think you're ready for it. I think you got it. All right, favorite hunter skin? Uh, Wraith, Mountain Man, or honestly, the new Trapper skin. So, favorite feature or update that we've added since you've been playing? It could be a trait, it could be Making a weapon. Making better. Okay. And making Springfield better. Okay. Those two. Also, making every ammo type available off the rip, thank you. That's also, that's number three. Um, which boss do you have the most challenge dealing with? Uh, Scrap Beak is ridiculous. Who wins in a fight, Butcher or Scrap Beak? Scrap Beak. Okay, who wins between Scrap Beak and Assassin? Assassin. Who wins between Assassin and Spike? Assassin. Yeah, I think Assassin wins yeah. out, guaranteed. Give him less health. <laughs> Change my answer. Assassin's the worst. Uh, Dad, he's so yeah. tough to fight against. He, he, he takes forever. <laughs> you know what I saw the other day? I saw a whole team with 12 beetles. 12 beetles? Yep. What'd you do about that? Nothing die. <laughs> they all had soccer beetles. Yeah. What the hell's going on here? Yeah! You had three players with four? Right. I was like, yo, when does it stop? Uh, ask maybe. him if they killed Farting. My name is Farting right That's now. That's such a good name. So ask him if they killed You got him. it. <laughs> so, favorite map? Favorite map or favorite POI? We'll go POI. Yeah. Lost in Station. Every time I spawn on Lost in Delta, I go to Lost in Station immediately because I know there's going to be people there. I know there's gonna be, there's always a fight. There's always a fight at Lawson. And there I is. love it, and it's the best. It's awesome. Right, okay. What's the worst way to lose your hunter? Disconnecting. <laughs> Second worst way. <laughs> Wait, that doesn't count? <laughs> That's a totally valid way. Traps, death traps. Death traps are, yeah. On extract. Oh. oh, 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 oh. That's the worst. That's the, that's the way of the coward. So, we have a lot of different definitions for what winning a hunt match is, right? Sure. We have some people who are like, I just need to get the token and get out. Sure. Other people are like, I gotta kill the whole lobby. Yes, sir. What is winning a match in hunt for? More of the latter. Yeah? Yeah. You gotta kill everybody. Yeah. And that's not the way my buddies play, so I have to convince them. I'm like, you hear that over there? Let's go. We already got the bounty. Let's go get these dudes. You got five seconds. I got five seconds. Let's go get these dudes. And they're like, no, no, we gotta get out. And I'm like, I don't know. I wanna go get him. Okay. And show him how I got this bounty. Say, what's good? I got this. And then I die usually. <laughs> All, right. All right, man. I appreciate the time. It's been fun. It. Thank you, sir. Yeah, thank, thank you. Thank you very much. Let's fucking rock.